That's when it's my favorite. It makes your eyes twinkle. Does it now? Half price if you buy two. Wow. You again. Is this your store? <laughs> no, my father's. How much? 800 rupees, please. 800 rupees? Okay, okay for you, 550. Incredible. So, does your father usually leave you here alone? No, he's away fighting the devils. Oh. The Indian Army called him up, did they? No, he volunteered. Really? Well, if it was my choice, I wouldn't leave you here alone. Oh. That's 300. Bet the deal. 400 rupees plus Ganesh. <laughs> you don't want this. It's broken. See? You don't know the story? Ganesh fought Parashuram while standing guard at his father's door. Yes, to defend the honor of his father, Shiva, and got his tusk hacked off for his troubles. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, it's not for sale. <sighs> right on time. Okay, look. 600 rupees. You can keep the change. Hey, wait! Hey! You need the guy. Oh? And what'll that cost me? <laughs> My sister needs me. How am I supposed to get it? Oh, I <laughs> What? Don't get me wrong. Decent technique on the lift. But I'd like my Ganesh back. Please. <sighs> Fine. A for effort, kid. The bridge is too dangerous. Listen, kid, it's been really fun. You need to make yourself scarce. I have a spare bed in the store. 300 rupees. Best deal in all of India. Ah. Okay, no thanks. I need to get on this truck. Bad idea. The rebels, they hurt people. Listen, I need to help my friend, okay? Tell you what, when I get back, Pizza's on me. Deal? Deal. Okay. Shit. Damn it. <sighs> sir, oh, sir, oh, please. Oh, God. My dad, we were eating ice cream. I can't find him. I can't get home without him. It's okay. Why not? He was standing over okay. there.
What's your rush? How do I know you're not smuggling something in here? Arms up. Hey. It's dangerous to be out so late. Hey! Where do you live? What are you, deaf? Answer him! I said, where do you live? Arab Tazan. I'm in the middle of something. It can wait. Uh, yes, sir. Meet me inside. Understood. You, with me. Man the gun. Sir, what about her? Just let her through. You, get going. Lucky for them, I've got somewhere to be. Red door. Check. Not this way. Shift ends in an hour. I need sleep. You can sleep in the truck. No, thank you. Is that the last of them? Almost. There's a couple more in the alley. I'm moving out tonight. Can't wait. I'm tired of these people. No. Asal says one week. Another week in this shithole. Remember the end goal, brother. Okay. Still have that bottle of coconut or I might. What does it work to you? Great timing. My eternal gratitude. Not good enough. Yeah. <laughs> He needs more
not until we pick the stick. It could be we must keep to the shadows. The army has eyes everywhere. Holy shit. Right. Active water. Lotus. Not what I was picturing. There was at least two targets. One was the warehouse, the other... You're in the wrong place, girl. What the... <laughs> I've got you now! You're late, Fraser. I see you too! Holy shit! Need to cut the bus squad! What the hell was that? I thought you were a professional. Oh, you should relax. You'll live longer. Relax? It took me weeks to track down Asov. The man's as unpredictable as they come. He's just another warmonger with no war to fight. No, you don't know him like I do. He changes location and routines by the hour. We'd be foolish to take unnecessary risks. We? Let's get one thing straight. This is my gig. You want your share? We play by my rules. What's it gonna be? He's the one with the beard. That's the spirit. Mm. Handsome. If you're into psychopaths. Nobody's perfect. Where's base camp? Top floor balcony. All right. Let's do this. Had a street route all planned out. They'll be looking for us now. What do you suggest? I'll think of something. Give you a boost up. <sighs> there you go. Thank you. Now what? Patience. <sighs> Up here. Really? Really. Careful <laughs> on this one. You sure this is safe? No. Come on, this way. 
You realize we're moving away from a salt skin? Yeah, we're taking the long way. Now I see why you're always late. Cobra one. Certainly lives up to her reputation. We avoid crates from now on. Okay, good deal. Up ahead. Shit. Ah. There's some cheap office supplies if you want them. So just take a moment. There's one. <coughs> oh, that works. Let's find that disc. Thank you very much. Watch our backs, yeah? Yeah. Crossed. It's like walking through an antique shop. He's been a busy boy. How much do you think it's all worth? Enough to keep his little insurrection going for quite some No one will miss this. Lakshmi, goddess of wealth. It doesn't bother you. These are all Indian artifacts. It's not my fight. Hmm. I'll just borrow this. 
Fraser. Mm hmm. Come here. That looks promising. It's locked. Not for long. What was that map? Western Ghats, Wesala territory. Shit. No, it's all right. Nothing we didn't already know. Time to go. Nadine Ross. What a pleasant surprise. Ah, ah, careful, brothers. This tiger's got claws. A soft. Oh, all these years. And you haven't aged a day. You're too kind. <laughs> Are you looking for work? I hear that Shoreline's under new management. Temporary setback. Nothing I can't handle. Of course, of course. Pity, though. My men and I could use someone of your caliber. This isn't your area of expertise. It, it is a nice collection, I must say. Chloe Fraser, collector of antiquities. A thief? You're working for a thief. Sir, we have a situation. The disc. Oh, right. About that. At first, I mistook you for just an average rebel. Oh. But you have managed to find the Hoysala Empire. That's not bad. Their greatest treasure. The Tusk of Ganesh. Now that's not an easy find. What are you doing? Three Persian invasions. Three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of Hoysala society. Exactly. Mm. An expert in their culture and history. My rates are reasonable. A parasite who exploits our struggle in order to fatten her pockets. Hmm. So that's a no. Don't like it. <laughs> You've got balls. I like that. But I don't need any more so-called experts. Shoot them. Throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out. After them!
hell was that back there? Messy but effective. You were going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I knew it. You were going to give me up. Because the leopard can't change her spots. You know nothing about me. Fair warning. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. There's your river. Yeah? And your guy better be there. Shit! Yeah, well, time to go! Come on! Guys! going out there. On schedule. Should hit land in about an hour. Great. The tusk of Ganesh. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on Asav's so-called expert? Don't worry. But if Asav's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons, transports, hundreds of men. Like I said, don't worry. <gasps> Looks like some kind of key. Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesha's weapon. The bow and arrow was Parashurama's, and the axe was a gift from Shiva. The great battle. What? The battle in which Ganesh lost his tusk. I bet we find these symbols. We find the tusk. Not bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. You like my dad for that. Hindu myths were his thing. I'd have rubbed off. You must be proud. Sun's almost up. I'll go get ready. Nice work.
It is a long way to go to settle an argument. Just for my peace of mind, all right? <laughs> well, nice view. And look. How weird. I'm sorry I doubted you, Chloe. Is her cellar? Oui, cellar. It's not a modern structure, so we're in the right track. What? I don't like it. You don't like anything? No. We've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of a sov. Glass half full, maybe we got the jump on them. Unlikely. I'll find the tusk. A salve's on you. Understood. Meet you back at the car. Yep. Back at the car. Yep. on it. I'm fine, by the way. There we go. Okay. Good, actually. Okay. Want me to drive? Nope. I don't mind. I do. It's a control thing. Sure. <sighs> Let's just enjoy the serenity, shall we? Got a dumb question. So much for that. How do you know the tusk is still there? It would have turned up in a museum or something by now, right? Plus, I haven't seen any Hoysala exhibition. I've never even heard of the boy Salah before this job. Yeah, well, that's the fault of their last king, really. Young, reckless, fires wealth, built a new capital to house the tusk. And then led the Persians right to their doorstep. And now us. And now us. Go convention. See your way forward? Looking. in that. So, quite nice to be outdoors, isn't it? 
Away from the city? Quieter. You come back here often? No. Not really. Oil up ahead. Slow down. Look at this. Koisala ruins. Can we get through that gate? I'll check it out. We got Halabadu and Balor. I thought these were Ganesh and Shiva. Hmm. Someone's been paying attention. Ganesh was the guardian of Halabadu, the newer of the Hoysala capitals. Shiva was the guardian of the former capital, Balor. Well, the stonework is beautiful, but this isn't much of a defensive wall. Mm. Sculptor's quarters, by the look of it. We're still on the outskirts. Didn't take you for an archaeologist. That would be my dad, actually. I'm just a thief, remember? <clears throat> hey. <clears throat> Is the rental equipped for the winch? Looks that way. Oh, great. I'll make short work of these gates. What, you're just going to pull them down? That's the plan. Unless you bought dynamite. This is your gig. Take that as a no. Right. That should no, do the Fraser. trick. Fraser, move. It's an ambush. Oh, shit. Take cover. Oh, Take the heads up. Take them down. Frost is all. Figured you'd be more of a leave no trace type when it comes to Indian runes. Sentimentality in this line of work? Get you killed. <laughs> Whoa! What? <laughs> they're just large flying rodents. Actually, no, they're not. Yeah, they are. Get closer to primates and lemurs. Okay, well, I'll look it up. 